load has been discussed uh, by uh, our uh, uh, from the industry side, from institution and entrepreneurship institutions, also from academia and ministry side. Uh, and Dr. Saxena, uh, we have Dr. Uh, N. P. Singh, my senior, who has been guiding me. It's very important to have a skill development in all spheres of uh, uh, industrial development and renewable energy is uh, more important in the sense that uh, we don't have the already existing infrastructure or the specialization in the field of renewable energy. That Rusa was talking about the IREP, that time the skill development was to, to develop skilled people who are ITI or uh, 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 unemployed diploma holders in rural areas who can be trained to meet the needs of implementation of the integrated rural energy program that system we were distributing in different uh, rural uh, areas. If anything goes wrong, who will repair them, who will maintain them, and how that program will be implemented in that sense. And now the role of renewable energy has uh, become very much uh, visible. And uh, about 40 to 42 institutions are already awarding degrees. Uh, my experience is also there, like in Tezpur Central University, we started the first this uh, master's degree. First, we started diploma, and uh, along with that, the MTech in renewable energy. And uh, many agriculture universities institutions they have in Ilabad also. We started MTech in renewable energy, but it's uh, very few programs are there. We 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 want these programs to be at a larger scale. Means each institution should have. Uh, because now the, uh, the contribution and the share of renewable energy is 13 percent. It will be 17 percent by 2017, and further will go 1 lakh 75,000. This ambitious target to meet that, we require huge manpower to implement those programs. Even from the industry side, people they don't find skilled people who will manage the projects, who will implement the projects, who will maintain the projects. For that, at a larger scale, we require people. So here, uh, no single individual can do the job. Although from our ministry side, uh, now we have gone into very much specialization rather than talking renewable energy as such. We have decided that bioenergy has a different background, different type of knowledge, and different type of skill development and research is required in bioenergy. Similarly, in wind energy and the solar energy, they cannot be merged together because the background knowledge is different and the, the, the research uh, uh, background should also be different for different uh, resources. So uh, our ministry has already established all the three institutions, National Institute of Solar Energy in Gurgaon, National Institute of Wind Energy in Chennai, and my institute that is uh, National Institute of uh, uh, this Renewable Energy. Now we are a National Institute of Bioenergy. So we want to go in that very much specialized uh, uh, working in this area and with a quality output. I mean, it's not just uh, we give a, a superficial knowledge and just repair and maintain. No, they have to execute the project, so we will train the people to that level. And skill development has to be done at all levels. Academia, yes, we require. If we don't have the teachers, how the students will be prepared? But at the same time, we require the engineers also. We don't have special program in engineering, so we will add some components in the, in the relevant branches where people, they are uh, trained. Maybe the, the last semester we can give projects from uh, uh, renewable energy institutions and then the engineer is trained, specialized uh, in this. Be because flexible system is coming and there we have the scope that in six months we can give. So we have developed module also, course curriculum for, for ITI, diploma holders and degree holders. In bioenergy we have developed, in solar energy we have developed. It's, a, it's, it's just a humble beginning and if we work together, I think we will be able to meet uh, the, the challenges, but it will not be 20 have been trained, or 50 have been trained. We will have to talk in millions and billions. And that type of skill development has to be done in the country to meet the target uh, of uh, the uh, renewable energy installation in the country. And in uh, bioenergy session also, we will be speaking more. Thank you very Thank much. You very much. Uh,